Alright, so what do we got here? Alright, so we got the Hika AA1640 amplifier. Nope, power amplifier. <laughs> Anyways, so we just replaced all the outputs in it. So this thing had uh, 16 outputs, 8 per side, but we had to replace the drivers too because it would look cool. So that's 20 TL3 transistors. Here's a shot of the inside, the emitter resistors, output transistors, power transformer, and so on. So we that's... also upgraded the caps to way more UF. Oh, uh, these are uh, the original stock capacitor was 7,500 microfarads each. These are 18,000 microfarads each. So it's got quite a big, uh, quite a big jump. All right, so let's see. All right. So what is this thing rated at? Rated at 200 per channel at 8, and we're going to be testing it at 8 ohms. Now, that's a quick little side note. These original outputs that just uh, about three of them failed about a week ago were the original transistors we put in when this amp was built 45 years ago. All right, original owners, the whole nine. So let's give it a shot. Again, rated at 200 watts. We're doing at 1,000 hertz, by the way. 1,000 hertz, 8 ohms, as usual. Ah. So we're at minus 10 right now. Oh, so that's 20 watts. Ish. <laughs> 18 volts, 20 volts. So that's about 50 watts at 8 ohms. All right, so now we're getting to the 200 on the meter. Oh, nice. So it's... 30, 40 volts on a meter, and 40 volts is exactly 200 watts. That's, that's gonna, perfectly accurate. Look at that, 40 volts squared divided by eight ohms is 200 watts, and there you go, right on the... All right, so we still have a clean wave, so let's keep So going. let's zoom in on this so we could see, so we don't, people don't say we're cheating. Can you see the meter? Yeah. It's still going. Is it squaring off yet? Oh, back off a little bit. I see both of them squaring off. A little bit more, here more. Right there, 54.9. So let's do the math for that. It's, you know, 54 times 9 squared divided by 8. All right, here we go. 376, 376 watts. They just don't make it like that anymore. Um, rated at 200, it did 176 watts more than it's supposed to. All right, so let's hook it up to uh, these little B&W speakers here and give it a listen. All right, so we're going to give it a little listen. We're going to be playing Smokey's Lounge by Tribe Tribe, so let's see how it does. <laughs> output should hopefully last another 45 years and uh let, let us know what you guys think all right say bye, bye.